So this tutorial will um, demonstrate how to install the trial version on your computer. We have the trial folder, so whether you have downloaded or whether you have a CD, you should have a trial folder. Ideally, the DVD for the trial will auto start. In this particular case, since I've downloaded it from the uh, from a website, I will be able to start it up myself. So ideally, um, when we open up the folder, we have the startup exe. Uh, normally, uh, under Windows environment, it's always best rule of thumb to always run things as administrator. It's not a it's not a must, but it's it doesn't hurt to use it. So we're just going to go ahead and run the inst the installation procedure. Obviously, opening file security warnings. Just hit run. So we just let the system do what it has to do. Okay, once we have here the um, installation dialog, the first thing you will be aware is that it is jumping straight into a uh, trial registration so obviously you need to fill this information out in order to have a usable trial version um, this as soon as this information will be automatically uh, entered uh, the trial see the trial uh, version will automatically generate or this form once it's filled out would automatically generate a um, validation code for you so I'm gonna go ahead all the data I'll accept the agreement uh, once the registration form has been bill filled out uh, with all the uh, required information once you've sent that information out once you said you've accepted the agreement um, that information will auto generate a validation code for you which will be emailed to you very shortly it doesn't take too too long maybe two to five minutes uh, you should be able to receive that make sure you don't have the email sent to your spam uh, by default or by by mistake um, take a look at that and see if you didn't receive any um, email for the trial uh, validation code just inform uh, one of the tech support agents and they'll be able to figure that out for you so once that is done I'm gonna continue the procedure I'm gonna hit next um, in this particular dialog here I can specify a few things obviously I can leave all this by default since it is a trial CD I don't necessarily need to play too too much with uh, this information because I will be deleting it of course um, the trial version does not allow you to do any commercial stuff on it so therefore whatever you do in a trial CD you will not uh, you will not be able to keep so um, obviously rule of thumb just install this in the location to run some tests and after once you finish running your test then you can go ahead and delete this so basically here the one very uh, important uh, element to type in is to put in your company code obviously here the company code uh, stands for the company name so whatever company you're working for just put in the company information here which is the name of the company in this particular case I'm just gonna put in my company here I'm just gonna say Epon USA with a space and this is going to create a folder with all the information that is required to run the, pro the, the application so forms uh, plot frames sim libraries macros and everything that you need to run uh, your trial experience down here you have measuring unit you can also specify if you want to run in a millimeter environment or if you want to run in an inch environment basically which stands for millimeter is for IEC and inch is for NFPA now of course all depending uh, we recommend to use the millimeter environment because we do have some tutorials and we do also do have some examples and the getting started guide is in a IEC environment so it, since this version is to test um, and just to see some of the functions we can use the millimeter environment not a problem I will continue with the next function here and of course I can have some customization uh, for the application but obviously since it's a trial version I'm gonna be very limited so the default uh, functions or formats are good enough for me I will select here the install uh, button and this will start the install procedure now of course the installation procedure will take some time um, you will just have to be patient uh, it should take about five to ten minutes it will do all the uh, uh, information that has to be installed into the particular locations and once that's done I will be able to continue my installation uh, procedure so uh, once this is finished installing I will come back once the installation has finished um, we will proceed by selecting here the finish button and we can see that we now have an ePlan trial icon on our desktop 
and we will be able to start our ePlan experience with the ePlan icon on our desktop. So that's pretty much it. Just click on the finish button. We're done. We can uh, close uh, this folder and we are now ready to begin our trial experience.